New at five, close to 100 crime scene photos and the murder weapon were shown today in the trial of a man accused of killing his stepfather last year. Eric Hernandez gives us a look at that evidence and who we can expect to see on the stand in the days to come. The yard area. One by one, the state went through dozens of crime scene photos in court today, showing the jury what was found at the home 49-year-old Mark Ramos was shot at. Ramos was allegedly shot by his stepson, Jaron Garcia, last March after an argument between Ramos and his wife escalated and Jaron got involved. E2, three were live rounds found in the yard. 11 shell casings, both live rounds and spent casings were collected at the scene as well as the 9mm handgun and a 30-round magazine. Photos of injuries on Garcia were also shown. He had scratches on his arms, face, chest, and neck, a busted lip, and bruising above one of his eyes. During opening arguments yesterday, the prosecution said Ramos at no time physically attacked Garcia and that his mother, Bertha, was trying to get him to put the gun down. But the defense claimed Ramos was the aggressor. We were expecting Bertha Garcia, Jaron's mother, to take the stand today, but because of a late start yesterday and a late start today, that has yet to happen. But we are being told that she will eventually take the stand. Now, if found guilty, Jaron is facing up to life in prison. At the Kadena Reeves Justice Center, Erica Hernandez, KSAT 12 News.